terrorists. Hold on. Here's Tara's Daily Rant. But what's interesting about this hearing we just had on this, aside from the fact that it's incredible alarming and that incredibly alarming, and this is the equivalent of the government keeping a file on you. They have a file on everyone. What is in your file? That the FBI now searches with impunity. They just, you know, feel like searching it. They just do. You know, hey, it's a felony, but does anyone really care? What's in your file? More than we thought. This is one of the significant things we learned last week. Now, you probably already know that every text you've ever sent is in your file. They've got that. Every social media post, including those you did not post, but merely keyed in and then thought the better of it in the moment of anger. Every text message, every email. Every instant message, every direct message, every geolocation identifier on you ever. I bet you didn't know that. I've got a record of where you've been. It's in your file. Every purchase you've ever made with electronic funds. Let that sink in. Do you use electronic funds and not cash? They know. They not only know the amount, they know what you bought. Guess what else is in your file? All of this came out in the congressional hearing last week with Michael Horowitz. You ready for this? Your banking records, all of them. Not just what you turned over to the IRS. Or, no, all of them. Every transaction, every deposit, every withdrawal. Every electronic purchase with the details of what you purchase. Every social media post. And even more terrifying, every keystroke you've ever done. So suppose... You were going to search for something that you know, might seem not illegal, but it's a little embarrassing. We've all done that. I'll go first. I'll fess. I've done that. And you typed it in. You're like, no, nah, I don't want to go there. Uh, that's not something I should be looking at. They have the keystrokes. Think about that for a minute. They have the keystrokes. You never had to press send. If you type something in a moment of anger that you were going to post on Facebook and you thought, yeah, that's not a good idea. It could affect me professionally. So you never hit post. They have it. They have your keystrokes. Suppose you were writing an email to your spouse. A moment of anger or something off color. But you never sent it. You deleted it. They have your keystrokes. Everything you've ever typed in, they have it. And when the FBI illegally at a felony level searched over one million times. That's what they went into. That's the file on you. And Conservative Treehouse asking a great question about this hearing. I mean, it's, it's beyond jaw-dropping. Who authorized this? Nobody. The FBI is supposed to protect Americans under the FISA 701 law. Protect them. In other words, Americans' data is never supposed to be accessed. Once they stumble upon a name of a person who is identifiably American, they are not allowed to look at it. The NSA employees are not allowed to look at it. The FBI employees are not allowed to look at it. It's supposed to be turned over to the FBI to mask that person with masking software and to mask their details. Instead, the FBI is like, ha, cool, political research database, let's go. And they did. Terra is swatted. Hear the Terra Show weekday mornings on News Talk 98.9. W-O-R-D, the voice of the Carolinas.